Wolfgang Tepo, CIA, Broccoli's, and Baby Crystals. These are the secret codes that are used amongst anti-government protesters. Not sure what they mean? We got you covered. Let's start with the easiest one, the CIA, which refers to street food vendors at the rally sites. These vendors, especially those that sell meatballs, are named CIA for their ability to predict where protesters will gather and arriving at rally sites beforehand. Some vendors are also suspected of sending information about the protest to authorities. The FBI, according to the protesters, is short from Food and Beverage Institute or people who provide food and drinks to anti-government protesters at rally sites. Some of the terms have clear resemblance to popular food items. Mocha refers to the police in coffee-colored uniforms. Oliang, literally Thai black coffee, refers to riot police in black. Broccoli is used to describe the military because they're usually in green, while carrots refers to monks, and of course, the baby carrots refers to novice monks. And here's the answer you've been waiting for. Gang Tae Po, a popular Thai curry that has been given a whole new meaning. The word gang or curry sounds like glang, which means to fool or trick somebody. Te literally means to pour, is slang for dumping somebody. And you guessed it, Po is short for police. Therefore, Gang Tae Po refers to the protesters' strategy to fool the police into heading to a wrong place, leaving them confused, while the real protest site is at a completely different location. What about the baby crystals? These colorful small beads are said to resemble the massive gatherings of anti-government protesters wearing different colors of raincoats and outfits, shining bright like a diamond. Minions is another term commonly used by protesters. The yellow characters from the Despicable Me series refers to the men in yellow shirts with short military haircuts at royalist gatherings. Natasha Romanoff, a fictional Russian spy from the Marvel comics, is often used to refer to spies infiltrating the anti-government protests. While Donald Dumb is a nickname that protesters use to describe Prime Minister General Prayut Oshha as the Thai version of the U.S. President Donald Trump. Most of the terms communicated by the protesters during the rallies or through their telegram chats appear to have heavy references to food items or popular cartoon characters. These new terms have spread quickly, both on social media and mainstream media. But as the authorities start to break the code, the young protesters are coming up with new terms to keep them guessing.